guys, welcome to another episode of Sunny Side Up Food Review. And today I'm going to be doing a review on some newer Krispy Kreme donut flavors. Um, so I wanted to get the new Oreo donut that they released, but they didn't have that one. Um, I came too late, I think she said they just like ran out. So I was able to get instead the Maple Glaze Donut, which isn't new, but it's new to me because I have not tried it yet. And I'm like so excited to try it because it looks really good. And then I also got the New York Cheesecake Donut, um, Cake Batter Donut, and the Reese's Donut. So I have four new donuts to try. I'm going to start off with the cake batter donut. So this is what it looks like. The sprinkles, yellow glaze, and some donut there. <laughs> and this is, it was, let's see, it appears to be around $1.29. Um, I got three donuts lumped into one price, so I can't tell what this individual one will be, but I believe it's like $1.30 or so. So I'm going to try this. Now, and I believe this has some type of like cake batter filling too. It does. The dough itself is very good. The frosting is too. And I'm gonna eat it again so I can get some more of this filling. This is definitely a really good donut. Um, and the filling does take, taste like cake batter, so they did a really great job with that. Um, from what I saw on the website, I think they took it away but bought it back because it was in popular demand. So this is a really good one that a lot of people like and I can definitely see why. It's very yummy. So I would give this a 4.5 out of 5. Now moving on to the New York Cheesecake Donut, which looks like this. It's got a crumb topping. And that's what this side looks like. So this would also be price pointed around one dollar and thirty cents. This crumb topping is really good. And now I'm gonna get to the filling part. The filling is really good as well. But to me, it does have more of like a lemon, a lemony custard flavor, which is kind of weird. Like it kind of tastes cream cheese, but it's a strong lemon flavor, which is surprising. I don't mind it at all, but um, it's definitely unexpected. <laughs> this is definitely a good donut, though, overall. I would give this a 4.5 out of 5. I would definitely buy it again, um, but just with the lemon flavor, for people that don't like lemon flavor, they may not like this. I don't know, it could just be me, but I really do feel like it has like a lemon, a lemony vibe. But it's so good. Okay, so moving on to this Reese's Donut. So I see it's chocolate, peanut butter glaze there. And I'm sure it has some type of really yummy peanut butter filling. So let's see. This one isn't too bad. It has peanut butter um, chips on it and then it looks like pieces of peanuts on it. Let me see if there's a filling. Oh yeah, so there's a filling. Just takes a while to get to it. So I'm gonna break this in half. And then, the filling is very good as well. It has a good Reese's vibe to it. I would say the only thing I don't like is the, the peanuts, just the raw peanuts that are on top. Um, it's just a little bit too overpowering for all the other flavors. Though it is nice to have a, like, a little crunchy aspect to stuff. I feel like it just kind of is like a little bit of overkill. But otherwise, it's very good, especially that filling. 
Although it does take a while to get to the filling, at least for this donut. You know, every donut's a little bit different. Um, but yeah, it's good. I wouldn't say I'd buy it again, but it's not, um, it's definitely not bad. So I would give this <clears throat> a 3.5 out of five. Okay guys, now for the last one that I have here, it is the Maple Glaze Donut. This is also $1.30 and there's the maple glaze. Let's see. The donut itself is very good, of course, because it's like a glazed donut, but I can't really pick up a strong maple flavor. It smells like a kind of strong, you know, maple, but it doesn't really taste super duper strong. But you get like a good hint of it, but really you're just tasting a lot of just a traditional um, glaze, like just a regular regular um, glaze donut type of vibe. And it's very sweet. Just tastes like sweet, regular plain glaze instead of maple. But it is a very good donut overall. Just a traditional glaze donut with like just a hint of maple. Um, so I would give this a, a 3.5 out of 5. I wish the maple was a little bit stronger or if they could have like put some in there, <laughs> made it like one where it's like maple in the middle or cream in the middle or something. But overall it's not bad. It's definitely sweet and um, definitely good. But I think if I had to pick one out of these, I would choose definitely between the cheesecake or the birthday cake. So I'm gonna take another bite of each and make my final decision. <laughs> okay, so I think out of these two, I would choose the, the cheesecake one. I really like this one. That lemony thing that it has going on makes it like refreshing. And I love like this topping this crumb, crummy topping that it has. Sort of like a cake crumb or bread crumb sort of topping thing. It's really good. And the cream is spread all throughout in the bottom and it's like a fluffy cream. And then the donut um, itself is, you know, soft and tastes really good. So yeah, I had to go for this. I'm almost done with it, but this is what the rest of it looks like. <laughs> So yeah, guys, I definitely recommend going to your local Krispy Kreme and trying out some of these new donuts. Um, let me know if you tried the Oreo one yet and if you like it. And definitely go ahead and try this cheesecake one. It's so good, I recommend this one. And then the cake batter one also is a close second. This is very good as well if you're in the mood for like a birthday cake flavored thing. So yeah, that is all for this review, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I will have new videos up for you guys soon. Please subscribe and like the video, and I will see you guys soon.